Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Um, if you're wondering why I have these glasses on, I started getting a headache after staring at the screens for so long. These are actually blue light glasses and a headache went away immediately. Um, it just filters out all the blue light. Um, so anyway, my eyesight is perfect. Has nothing to do with eyesight. But the blue light from staring at screens all day long, I feel like it was giving me a really bad headache. So anyway, who cares about that, right? Let's share the screen because what we care about this week is Apple's earnings report. And can we profit from it? Okay, so their earnings is on Wednesday. I think that's the 29th. Let me just double check because I don't want to give you guys um, the wrong information. Let me just see something. Hold on. Education. No, I don't want that. Where were we? Okay, there we go. It's on, yeah, Wednesday. And it is after the market closes. Okay, on Wednesday. So you have two trading days here before Apple reports. Okay, and you guys can find that in, you know, without stumbling around like I just did. I usually know how to find this really quick. I unclick all this other stuff and I just keep in earnings clicked in and it comes up with the calendar. And if you don't have Apple, because I typed in Apple here, but if you don't have Apple typed in here, you'll see this populate with all the earnings reports from all the companies. And you find that under market watch calendar. All right, so let's go back to where we were. Now, this is reading the, this is like a picture perfect cup and handle um, layout here in front of you guys. Now, what a cup and handle is, is a chart pattern that everybody is looking at. Okay, so look, here's where it made its high back in um, August at, where was that? About 137.85, right? Here's the cup, okay? If, if I was able to draw the lines here, I would for you, but here it starts up here. There's the cup, right? And then you get the pullback and this is the handle, okay? This is textbook, cup and handle pattern. So you have your cup, pull back handle, and then where, it's, where it comes back up. And now this is where it's going to break out and make new highs, okay? So how can we play this breakout? Well, you can do one of two things. You can buy call contracts, or you can actually buy the stock. It's up to you guys. Um, that's how I would play it. I mean, you have Monday and Tuesday, if you do buy options, you're going to be paying a hefty um, price for it because going into earnings, they're gonna collect on that. So you have to know that going in, um, but you, know, you can also just scalp it which is what I do. I, I'm a scalp trader. So if I buy options on this, I'm going to look to unload it pretty quickly. You know, whenever I see now my target on this is up to 150. That's where I think this cup and handle, because you got to realize it's not just us looking at these patterns. There's computers all over the world that basically you'll hear the term algorithms and algo trading, it's like 70% of all the trades are done by computers. They all see this, the computers anyway, that this is a cup and handle. And what they do is they jump on this also. So this is gonna probably, now I'm no licensed financial advisor, okay? So you guys have to realize that right now. I wouldn't follow, this is just my opinion, okay? Everybody has opinions. Jim Cramer, um, all these talking heads 
a lot of times they're wrong. I would say 99% of the time they're wrong. That's why if you do your own research, it's you that is, you can either be upset with or be, well, I actually read the chart. I did my due diligence and I caught the cup and handle breakout. So anyway, this is Apple. I hope you guys enjoyed this um, earnings preview on Apple. If you did, hit the thumbs up. It helps out the channel a lot, just starting out. So um, thank you to all my first time, you know, first subscribers. You guys are awesome. Appreciate it a lot. And, um, you know, there's going to be videos basically every day, just ramping it up even more, more trades, more action, and more chart reading like this to maybe help you guys out. So this is a cup and handle. And this is textbook. And this is Apple. Earnings are Wednesday. Um, I'm doing this research. I do this kind of stuff on the weekends. Um, so I know what I'm going into for the week. But anyway, this is just Apple. Earnings season is fully upon us right now. As you saw with the banks, they pulled back even though they did very well. So you have to keep that in mind too. We're at market highs. Every time we've hit market highs, we've pulled back. Let me see if I can um, pull up this. This is the SPY, okay. Every time we hit a market high, we pull back. Now this is just the crash. So I, who knows what this would have done if the coronavirus never happened. But hit a high, pull back, hit a high, pull back. And now we're at highs again. Will we pull back? You know, who knows, but that's how we keep going. So going in a straight line is not really going to happen without a pullback. So just be aware of that going into earnings season. We're at all time highs. Um, so just be aware that you could get a pullback and that's a good thing. You can buy on a pullback. You'll get stocks at a better price. All right. So um, anyway, thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you on the next video. Take care.